I am Anil Kumar and in the previous videos we have understood few aspects of periodic functions. We have seen the fill in the blank questions and some ways of finding whether a function is periodic or not and we have become conversant with most of the terms which will be used in the following videos. Now here is a very important question. The question here is explain the difference between cycle and period of a periodic function. Now, I really find it very difficult to explain what is the difference between these two. At times, they, they look similar, right? But they are actually two very different things. Now, can you tell me what is the difference between cycle and period of a periodic function? Uh, let me sketch one periodic function. Let us say this is a sine wave, right? And let us assume that it is being repeated and uh, uh, it is periodic. Let us assume it's periodic. That's to be on the safe side. So let us say this is periodic. Now, with the help of this periodic function, so we already have a periodic function. Can you tell me what is the cycle and what is the period in this particular function? Are they same things or different things? That is what we are going to explore and understand in this video. Now, period is kind of time period. Whenever we say period, then we are actually talking about the horizontal distance between two cycles. You understand? What I'm trying to say is, a cycle is portion of a graph which repeats. So, for example, here, this is one pattern. Now this pattern repeats, correct? So this is called one cycle. So cycle is basically, when we talk about cycle, then what should we look into? When we talk about cycle, we are looking into dependent variable. F of x, the y values. You understand? When we talk about cycle, then we are actually talking about the y values of the function, the dependent variable, right? And the complete pattern which is being repeated, that set of values is called one cycle, correct? So it's normally the dependent variables which constitute the cycle. On the other hand, period is horizontal independent value. When we say period, we are talking about independent variable. Which normally was along the x-axis. Let us say this is x-axis. It could be time, distance or whatever. It is the independent variable which tells you the time or the period after which a cycle repeats. Do you understand? So it is the independent variable which marks the repetition of the cycle. Right? So that is the period. So in this case, the period is this distance, the horizontal distance. So independent variable or you can say horizontal distance between two cycles. You understand? So whenever we talk about cycle, we are looking into the y values, the f of x. And the whole pattern will form one cycle. But when we say period, then it is the complete duration which a cycle takes or a duration after which the next cycle starts. So that is the huge difference between these two terms, correct? I hope is clear. Thank you and all the best.